Hello cellists! This is your note reading video for exercise number three in Alwyn Schroeder's 170 Foundational Studies, Volume 1. So, if you've been playing along, we've already done all these open strings, A, D, G, C, and then we've added first fingers, right? So you've learned one up from A is B, one up from D is E, and so forth with A and D. So just remember, if this is C, go up one letter in the alphabet, and one finger and you've got D. So far it's been pretty simple. We're learning on the cello, not on the page, right? So we're going to introduce now second and third fingers. This exercise is in C major. You may have already done your C major scales. You know that second fingers on the A and the D string and then third fingers on the G and the C string. So we're kind of using two fingers now instead of just one, but only one note name. So you can go up two from A a, B, C. That gives us that second finger. D, E, F. G, A, B. C, D, E. So we're going to have E, B, F, and C. As well as the other ones that you've already mastered. right? B, E, A, and D. A, D, G, and C. If it's a lot for now, um, then go back and review some of those other videos. See if you can't master the first fingers before you go on to the second and third fingers, which are combined in this exercise. So this is exercise number three. As always, I'm going to keep you on the metronome so that we count through our long beats. This was in three, four. A, B, C, C, B, C, about that fast. I've got it on 112 again. Anywhere between 100 and 120 would be just fine. Let's see our bows down. We'll pluck it through the first time. One, two, go. A, B, C, C. First time through, that usually doesn't go so well. So don't be disconcerted if it doesn't, okay? Keep working at it. You may need to turn the metronome off and just figure it out. Do it really slow. Maybe you turn it down to 100 and get used to it. Um, one problem that we all get is we want to sing when we're saying. And I don't know anybody that sings this low C. At least I can't, right? So it gets hard. We keep jumping around octaves. The cello has a much wider range than the human voice. So. Um, if you don't sing the right pitch that when you say it, don't worry about it so much, okay? Just try to keep going and get the right name or the right note. So, number three, those of you who have got it nailed that are ready for the bow, here we go. The rest of you, keep going slow, pluck, say, and play. Exercise number three. One, two, three. A, B, C, C, A, B, C, C, A, B, 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 C, A,
happy practicing cellists.